Hey guys, how's it going? Skagonia here, and as you guys can see, today we are reacting to Game Over Part 1, which I think is, yes, yeah, Season 2, Episode 6 of Glitch Tale by Camila. Now, as you guys heard from yesterday's video, if you've kept up, there was something that was arriving today, and it did arrive. And I even, I put as, like, I I put every, I bought the fastest shipping method. And it's the Bon Appetit mug. <laughs> the Bon Appetit mug lives on. Maybe this was a poor time to do this. Because I'm pretty... Yeah, I'm hearing someone mowing the lawn. The garbage can is coming in. It's... I should have known this would happen. Anyway, we got the Bon Appetit. So Gaster is with us, I guess. <laughs> anyway, with that being said, let us begin. I do not own anything Camila-wise. Uh... I do not own anything Camila wise, so just wanted to, you know, make sure that was in play. Uh, credit will be in the description below, both the channel and video. And with that being said, let us begin. For real this time. Ooh. That's, that's right. Okay, window. I, I was told to keep an eye on the window. What is up with said window? Yes. No locket. That was said before. Turn into dust. Yes. The way how it was. Oh, no. That's right. I need to get back. I need to get something from Azriel's room back at home. We'll go back to the city when I get it. The locket? Ooh! It is! I definitely don't like this. This doesn't make me feel happy. I hope you know this, Camila. Asriel, man, come to your senses. Come on. He won't listen. My locket. Yeah, yes. Do you remember it? We made one to each other. Where's yours? Ah, I know. You broke the one I gave you. So much for friendship, huh? I'm done talking with you. Ah, no, what? Wait, this is just a... <laughs> Do we just lose Kara too? Oh, no. I failed them. Don't give up. Don't. You're actually getting it. Erasing in progress? No. 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 
No, 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 wait, just give me one more chance, if I just had a few more seconds, if only for a brief moment, this can't end here. Stay determined! The window! The window! The window! The window! The window! No! Wait! Oh my god! I don't have much time. Kara! Was that actually you? Were you the one who opened the window? This locket must still be at home. But if there's a duplicate... Is... This all I can do? I should have done more. Maybe... You'll have a better chance now. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's why the window's open! <laughs> Different outcome deleted? Or detected? Creating timeline 2.5. Ah! Oh! That explains it! That explains it! That explains it! <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's Kara. The sandwich. What point in time is this? It's supposed to be after. I'm not sure why, but it feels. But I feel like it's been forever since I saw you. Even though we were just talking, I. I missed you too, Mom. Ah. Guess we're both feeling weird today. Huh. I'm glad you're okay, Kara. Huh. Hey, Dad. Huh. Kara, if you don't mind me asking, huh. what were you two doing down there? Asgore and I just heard a big explosion coming from Gasser's lab. When we got there, you two had passed out. We were worried. Okay, so this is following the... I don't really remember what I was doing. It's okay, little boy. Oh, I'm afraid that not even I can answer that question. Bon appetit. It doesn't help that my memory has been all over the place recently. There's no need to trouble yourself with that. The important thing is that you two are okay. I guess. For now, I suggest we talk and figure out what to do next. I'll catch up with you all in a bit. I need to do something first. No hurries. Take your time. Thanks. I realize I'm phasing in and out of reality. Um, Mom? What is it, dear? It's about Asriel. I think I know how to help him. I need to get something from Asriel's room back, uh, back at home. We'll get back to the city when I get it. I'm just gonna put this five to zero. Well, I suppose. Don't worry, I'll go with him. Very well, very well then. For now, it's getting rest. For now, it's getting late. Tomorrow, we'll take care of this together. Ah, I like how well the green screen is working now. <gasps> oh, but the lighting's off. 
Ooh. Well, that didn't. Boom. He's trying to find out the correct proportions, I'm assuming. Ooh. What was I thinking? Wait. Of course it doesn't work. Wait. What was that? Are those wingdings? If so, I'll have to decipher them. What was I thinking? Of course it doesn't work. I'm just chasing a fairy tale, even though I already know what happens when determination and monster magic is combined. A pinch more, a bit less, will result in death. Even if I get if I even if I get it right in time, there's no guarantee that it'll work in the long run. My generator will run out of energy soon as well. And if it works, would he would he be okay with it? Is it okay for me to just play God like this? How can I get the perfect combination between monster magic and determination? It's the best chance I have. Undyne's blood. This will work. What's happening? Is he like obsessed with this? Is it having some sort of effect? Can Sans really come back, please? What is going on with his eyes? It's going to be all right. It's stable. This is it. Please, please, Seance, wake up. And we need you to wake up. Any time now, it'll all be fine. Six fifty-eight a.m. I'm trying to be quiet because, like, the music, like, everything's quiet right now. But once things ramp up, her blood combines perfectly with determination. But even after injecting him with the final substance. It won't work. Come on, say it, wake up. In fact, it made it even worse. In fact, I made it even worse. Not only was I in incapable of reverting his state. But instead of letting him pass on in peace, the determination that was in the injection will force him to be fully awake to experience it. I failed in every possible aspect and made it worse for everyone else. You were only trying to bring him back. There's nothing wrong with that. I lied to him for nothing. Come on, Sans, wake up. Sans. Sans, wake up, please. We need you. We need you. <laughs> Quickly, run this way. Nice. Good lord. Hey, hey you, fish lady. You should go back to the refuge. 
There is- this is no place for civilians. I'm not a civilian, I'm a cop from the city. I'm doing my duty for evacuating the civilians. Trying to keep an eye on volumes. A monster is a cop? What do you mean by... That's really cool. I'm sorry if that came out wrong. I don't get to see many monsters in this city I'm working at. Which, much less serving as a police officer. My name is Ronan Cass, police chief from the, uh, whoa, wh wait, the whatever district, because I can't pronounce that. Though I only work there, I live here with my family. Jessica called me, saying she needed help in there, help in here. <laughs> nice to meet you too. My name's Undyne. Let's do our best to keep everyone safe, okay? Ronan here. I'm kind of busy at the mo- What? What is he doing here? <sighs> Actually, I have, an, I have an idea of what he wants. Bring him back to safe perimeter 01. I'll be there in a minute. Everything alright? Not sure. You can come along if you want. I'll leave the rest of this area to my men for now. We actually might need help this time. I'm gonna bring it down. Hello there! I was told the one in charge of the situation would be here. I heard about this little issue on the news, and I couldn't help myself. Hey. I'm quite busy at the moment, so why not get to the point? Uh. I know why you're here, Rave. Hmm. You know the rules of this city. I can't just ignore them and let you use your magic weapons here. Huh? I don't... Of course! I'm perfectly aware of that. I believe you misunderstood me. I said I wanted to talk to the one in charge. Not her dog. So, where's Jessica? Recovering. Oh, she's look she looks like she's seen better days. <laughs> Hello, Jessica speaking. J Jess, are you alright? I've had better days. What's going on? Aw, Toriel. Hmm, cute. It's Rave. He demands to talk with you. Directly. I know you're not in the best conditions to come, but I, he might gain control over this issue if I don't have proof that you put me in charge. I understand. Send a vehicle and my field suit over to my location. I'll go. Roger that. Take what you- Oh. I'm bringing it up by five decibels. Miss Jessica, are you feeling better? Uh, yeah, much better. <laughs> I see my clothes fit you perfectly. <laughs> Th thanks for the clothes. God, this is embarrassing. Hopefully my car will get here before more people see. <laughs> Miss Jessica! I see you're feeling better. Yeah, somewhat. It's been forever since I've done Papyrus. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. 
Why are you up, though? I recommend you stay in bed. I break. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, there's an emergency at the center of the city. My men need me there. But it's too dangerous for you to go alone. I'll go with her. No. No, you're not going. I told you to stay to look after your brother. But if you're staying here for that, th why can't I go then? You said you were done looking for things. Because it's dangerous. That's exactly why I want to go. Not only because of her, but because of but because other humans and monsters also need our help. I'm not asking you. I just want you to be safe. His eye, his eye, his eye. Ooh, it's almost... Papyrus? But his eye, it's almost gone. You're so selfish. I'm also worried about you. We need to talk. No, guesser, guesser, hold it together. Hold it. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh. Let go of me! Ah! Uh, yo, wait, chill, Gaster! Are you all right? Yeah. You know, that hurt. But not nearly as much as when I saw you saw. Uh, wait, hold on. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Okay. <laughs> But not nearly as much as when I saw you wounded by that creature. Hmm. Or when you lied to me about the lab. Oh, when you lied to me at the lab? Ooh, at the lab. My bad. Or when any of you prevent me from getting involved. Yeah. I'm tired of you thinking that I don't know what's going on. I know Sans is not doing well. I can feel it too. I know you're going through an unimagin I know you're going through an unimaginable pain and you can drag me all around the lab if you wish so and push me away as much as you want. But I refuse to let you go through this alone. Please let me help you. I don't deserve your help. Well, all I've done lately is, ma is make mistakes and make everything worse for everyone. Only mistakes. The only mistake you can make is not asking for help. You bonehead. I'm so sorry. Yeah, he's not. Ah. Uh. I believe that's for me. Alrighty. Papyrus, I need you to stay here. I'll go with her. If that's okay with you, you'd be you'd protect the lab while I'm gone. Got it. I'll stay safe. I promise. Okay, Papyrus, I'll be heading out with Asgore and Kara. Are you sure you'll be fine? 
worry not, your highness. I'll make sure this place stays safe. Very well, then. I'll see you soon. Ah! I like this! Looks like we're not getting any fight scenes. Not until the second part. Yeah, here it is. It's time, Asriel. Everything is set in place. We'll see who ends up running away this time. They're doomed to make the same mistakes. Credits? Okay, yeah. Now, I'm her. I've heard that from this point, like, like I'm, I'm gonna be checking the <clears throat> all the credits. No, wait, hold on, wait. But okay, here's one thing I don't like. I don't like the fact that Sans isn't on here. I don't like the fact that Frisk isn't on here anymore. Not happy. Not happy. Oops. Does that mean that we've lost Sans? I sure as hell hope not. We just got him back. Oh, that's it. Yeah, no, that's it. Ooh. Time taken. Three months. Dang. 24 FPS. That's 24 frames a second, guys. Wow. Anyway. The reason why I put it... <laughs> the reason why I put this video off was because of the Bon Appetit mug. Um, Camila, it's well printed. I'm loving it. Uh, Just got it today, as a matter of fact. Again, I, as I said previously, uh, this is a fine product. Uh, one hundred percent like it. Um, I apologize that you guys can hear those. <laughs> anyway, so Again, that's the whole reason I put this video off was so I could show off the Bon Appetit because I was planning on doing like uh uh I was planning on posting a video of Glitch Tale yesterday, but uh I decided eh you know tomorrow I'm gonna get the Bon Appetit mug might as well just wait it out uh wait one day post the video hopefully Camila sees this and uh understands how greatly I appreciate this mug. Chose the fastest shipping method, which basically doubled its price, but it was 100% worth it. And, um, on that note, yeah. You guys should definitely go and support Camila. Hopefully this does support Camila. And if she does see this, does this support you? I really hope it does. <laughs> I mean, it's got to. Um. I'm definitely also planning on helping her on Patreon as well. 100%. Because all of this that she's doing is taking up a lot of time. And I don't know what Camila does within the time that, you know, Camila does these kind of, uh, makes me worry a bit. And I definitely hope that Camila's doing all right. Um, making these, De I'm, I'm definitely hoping and praying that she is doing well because if she doesn't, then we're not going to get these amazing videos, these amazing animations. <laughs> but 
But here's the thing. Here's the way that I see it is, you know, we got the we got the ascension and then it's going to decline. We're in the decline section right now. We've lost a bunch of people. We've lost Alphys. We've lost technically Asriel. We're losing Sans. We've lost Frisk. But I feel like by the end of this, it's definitely going to come around. Also, I hope my voice acting was okay today because it's been a while since I've done it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for coming out to watch the video. You all have a fantastical day or night, whichever one it is for you guys, and I hope to see you guys in my next video.